Yes, the road to the White House runs right through Cleveland tonight. Andrew Horansky joins us live from the Cuyahoga County Board of Elections, where Senator Harris made a stop today. Hi, Drew. Hi, Lena. Well, good evening to you. So let's start with that story. Of course, we can tell you this, that her visit here was something of a secret. Normally, when a candidate of this sort of scale and stature makes a visit, we know the itinerary here in town in advance. That was not the case today with the can campaign keeping this very close to their chest. What we can tell you is that the uh, nominee for Democrat, the Democratic nominee for vice president arrived at Burke Lakefront Airport late this morning at around 11 o'clock. And from there, she went straight to lunch. She dined at Zanzibar's Soul Fusion today with Congresswoman Marsha Fudge downtown. And then she went to Lakewood, where she did a meet and greet outside a local store called Fetch and Company. Now, you may recall that her team was supposed to be here last week, but canceled after two staff tested positive for COVID. From Lakewood, the senator's motorcade went to the Cuyahoga County Board of Elections, where Harris got out briefly, then finally to Tri C. It was here at around 3 15 that she spoke to a crowd of about 75 people. Topics included the urgency of voting, but also what she calls President Trump's, quote, weird obsession with rolling back everything that President Barack Obama did in office, particularly when it comes to scrapping the 2010 health care law dubbed Obamacare. Take a listen. Can I say we don't need presidents with weird obsessions? We don't need <laughs> that. <laughs> There's so much at stake, so we must honor the ancestors, and that's why we vote. We vote because there is so much at stake. 